And... Our last one. Now I need to extract the core. Crates remind me of Borderlands. Blueprint white salty dog canine four legs. Okay. It's kind of neat. We can upgrade all of our our animals, our animal companions. here I wonder if they're gonna have uh, save spots like uh, Metroid uh. come on Look at here. Oh. Some kind of secret passage, huh? That's cool. I guess we gotta go this way. Back to white. When the mandate discovered Far Eaton, they called it a new horizon for humanity. But all I knew was that it would be the place that would take my daughter away from me. Don't get me wrong, Jewel. I was so proud watching you compete to become a member of the Far Eden team. And I knew you leaving was partly my fault. Since you were little, it seemed all we did was talk about space. About how incredible it would be to explore other worlds. And you're so much like your mother. Brave, kind, a little reckless. Earth was too small for her. And I guess small for me too. What makes me happy is that we'll be able to work together and then we'll be far apart. Test my new invention, Core AI. If we succeed, we won't just have built humanity a new home. 
will have revolutionized the relationship between humans and artificial life. I didn't go back that far. I'm just not going to worry about the course for a while. Okay. You know the save points are uh, pretty clear. And we have a door up here. Find something? Take a look. Mac is now level 5. Jules' weapon is now level 5. Neato. Do you hear that? There must be another one of those cores nearby. That is some nasty stuff right there. Whatever's going on with that this corruption. around here somewhere. Matt, can you find it? You find it while I blow shit up. Fingers crossed. Ah, white wild child. Okay. Thing on that. But... Who's a good boy? That's number two. Hmm. Prismatic core. Maybe I have to come back later? There is something over there.
As you can see, there's something over there. There's a switch here. The switch opens that door. But we can't get to it yet. That's what I'm thinking. We've got some backtracking to do. The wonderful Metroidvania style backtracking. There's a little bit of graphics going weird right here. No, well, I guess not. I guess it's just rocks. They just look weird. Still say one. Oh shit. Goldcracker, Pylon 512 Enforcer. It's got six bars of health. Got me trapped in. face.
Back to the control room, buddy. You see that 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 rail right there? I think that's a spider rail. There was the hidden area that we already found. Now let's see what happens when we do this. Other side. Let's go take a look. Then I think I'm gonna it. go ahead and edit and upload these. So you guys can have it after uh, the day it launches. <coughs> oh, sorry, excuse me. Uh, got it right. I think I went the wrong way. There's an objective here. Hmm. I can't believe I took the wrong way out. Yeah, that's right. transfer plates work again? Okay. Select a transfer plate on the map to travel to its location. Find more plates to travel to more places. Got it. Oh, work points. Let's go outside first, though. That makes backtracking a little bit more easy. Is the storm over? Oh, so they do actually call it a dungeon. from an old emergency beacon on the other side of that gate. The storm must have been blocking its signal. Come on, Mac. You better go check it out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All who wake must die. Go! Holy crap. Oh, the world of Far Eden. The sun has shifted, revealing new adventures. You are now free to explore. 
off the main story path, seek out hidden dungeons, and where the fiercest enemies guard their best loot. Collect blueprints, craft materials, cores, and experience points by defeating wandering core bot. Upgrade your core bot companion at the workbench. This sector is filled with rogue core bots, Mac. Before we go much further, we should head back to our crawler so I can craft you some better parts. Roger that. Violet, I got places to go. <laughs> It doesn't look like the load times are too bad. Of course, I got it on the SSD. Right, let's get you geared up, Mac. Okay. So we have a limited number of spots, items that we can take. Or you know what I mean. But we can deposit everything into our workbench. Let's do, uh, no. White bear bones, white salty dog. Max health, so it's a tank one. Just 20 RNG. Well, we gotta do it now. I don't have enough for that. Okay. Let's see if I can put these, uh, wild child. White wild child. There we go. I just don't have enough for the tail. I mean the uh, not the tail, but the uh, the augment. So look at that attack, fifty-two energy. We can do core fusions. Make your friendly cores more powerful by fusing them with the cores you have extracted from enemy core bots, as well as core shards you have collected. The energy used for core fusion comes in three types. Red fusion will upgrade your core's attack, increasing the damage. Yellow fusion will increase your core's defense rating. And blue will increase your core's energy boost. Each time you core bot level up, they can be infused with more. Okay. Let's get him some more attack. I did want to save some of them. Let's just stay at even at 300. And... What is the RNG stat? <laughs> I don't know, but we'll... Strong versus that. Weak versus... Okay. We have that. There's our stash. We have, looks like we have more bots. Dang it. We don't have enough resources. Looking good, boy. Now let's get back to that distress signal. Look at him now. So, with that, I would like to save the game. If in any ways possible, I I don't know. There's a skull cracker. Yep, got that. Can we? Let's see what happens when we exit. We 
if we get the circle-y thing, I know the game is saved and we can... There we go. So I guess I'll see you next time. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. This is Tachi signing out. Have a good day. And goodbye.